up y'all welcome back to my youtube so today i'm going to be doing my own hair and as you can see it's a mess you know but i'm gonna braid it i was actually waiting for my lace to come and they said it was supposed to come today and i gotta go to work at five and it is three o'clock and i have to get started and i was gonna do a video of how I did my passion twist, but don't worry about it, girl, because I'm putting them back in. Those I like those, so I'm gonna put those back in, and I'm gonna show y'all exactly how I did them. But I'm just gonna show y'all how I do my braids, and we're just gonna get into that. So it's been growing. It looked like that, but it's been growing. But first, as you can see, I already parted my hair. I don't like you know going through and having to part it. I just part it and call it a day. As y'all can see, I done went all the way through. I done went all the way through. And I got a section off in like rubber bands and stuff. Brush it, add gel, and then braid. I'm gonna section them off in like the sizes that I want so I don't have to keep going in the pack and keep getting out little pieces of hair and taking all day. I'm just gonna tell y'all right now, I know damn well I'm not gonna make it to work at 05 and it's 3.30. Like, somebody gonna have to miss me, okay? And this ain't missing. So I think I kinda want them thick, but I don't want them too thick. And I think this is thick. So I bought about a good eight, nine packs and I don't have a lot of parts in my hair because I made them real big. But what I usually do, I'll go in with my gel, my eco style gel. I ain't got that professional camera, so you probably ain't gonna be able to see, you know, in the little quality that you want, girl. But I got eco style gel. I'll just go in before I start braiding, put it on my hair. Not a lot because I don't like when it's when it's all the way caked on, but just enough. Just enough to get like it down. You know what I'm saying? But before I start, I like to you know, tighten them up a little bit. I'm keep my I like to keep my rubber bands in because they help my braids last longer. You know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna start. And I like to add a little gel as I go, just to make the hair comply. You know, act better. Done with this braid. I'm going to let y'all see it up close. That's the first braid, okay? And I'm looking a mess now. But wait. And to make my braids longer, I like to, um, I like to, like, separate them. So you just basically take them, separate them, and, like, you know, bring it up a little bit and drop it. So then the bottoms is, like, uneven. You know what I'm saying? Because when you take it out the pack, it's even so you just take it you know do that however many times you want it however long you want it split it come there Girl. yeah so this is where we at i'm gonna do the rest and i'm gonna let y'all see when i come back as y'all can see i'm halfway done Halfway, because half of my hair is still out. This is the hair I got, by the way. If y'all don't know what hair to get. I just got, you know, regular canker line, girl. You know, you know what to get. What's to get stuff? So, this is how it's turning out. And I got about, like, three more braids left. I am so glad. I was getting tired of them other braids. My roots was looking a mess. Uh, so this is the final look and it just feels so good uh, it took me about three hours to do these with about eight bags of hair so and I parted them all so if you like this video make sure you click the post notification button so you know when I post click that thumbs up button if you like what I did I dipped the ends I dipped the ends. They're looking a little messy, but they're right. 
Alright y'all, I'll catch y'all next time on my channel. Bye.